Welcome to my channel. Today we have a list of 10 evil men throughout history. Now this list isn't really in any particular order as it's not really a competition. And I must say, usually I try and bring a bit of humour into these videos, but I'm really, I, I couldn't do it with this one. It's, you can't make fun of what happened with these ones. So, hope you bear with it and hope you enjoy. Number 1. Vlad Dracula Known mainly for the inspiration of the Dracula legend, Vlad definitely deserves a spot on this list. It was Vlad's particular horrendous torture method that landed him the title of Vlad the Impaler. He enjoyed suspending people from stakes that were inserted into the body in places best left to the imagination. Great care was made to make sure that the stakes were not too sharp, as this would have resulted in a quick death. Vlad much preferred a slow death. It would usually take hours or even days for the stake to slowly make its way through the body, working its way up to the head. No one was spared from this torture. Woman, child and even animals were subjected to this. Vlad was responsible for around 100,000 people's deaths and it was even rumoured that he drank the victim's blood. Number 2. Mao Zedong Mao was the dictator of China from 1943 to 1976. He had a dream to make China a superpower that would be respected throughout the world. Though this is true now, what he ended up bringing at the time was an era of pain and suffering. Under his rule, China suffered several economical disasters which led to the greatest famine and genocide in history. Millions of people were sent to labour camps and millions were executed. Nowhere near the promises Mao made to his country. An estimated 30 to 45 million people died from diseases due to unsanitary conditions. Around 700,000 people committed suicide. It is estimated that 70 million people died in total at the hands of Mao's rule. Number 3. Emperor Hirohito Hirohito was the Emperor of Japan from 1926 to 1989. In this time, he was responsible for numerous war crimes and many acts of monstrosities. He was responsible for enslaving 10 million Chinese people. Many of them were tortured to death and some were even eaten. Hundreds of thousands of rapes were documented, as well as the torture of people by mutilation, slicing, decapitation, crucifixion, burning, boiling, burying alive and many other despicable methods. 400,000 people died from disease and around 580,000 people were sent to become human guinea pigs in which they all died from their treatment. Hirohito's death toll was in the tens of millions. He died in 1989 from cancer. Number 4. Talat Pasha Talat Pasha was the Grand Visor to the Sultan in the Ottoman Empire in 1917 and 1918. In 1915, Pasha declared that the Armenian race should be wiped out. People were tortured, whipped, raped and robbed. The Armenian people were forced into slavery, and those that couldn't keep up with their harsh tasks were simply killed. During this madness, people were forced to rape their own family members, while others were killed by means of axe, hammers, saws and spades. Many people were subjected to having their sexual organs cut off while they were still alive. Out of the two and a half million Armenian population, around half of them met their end due to this man. Talat Pasha was ultimately assassinated in 1921 by an Armenian squad. Number 5. Joseph Mengel Joseph Mengel was a physician during the Second World War that worked in the Auschwitz camp. He was in charge of selecting Jews to go to the concentration camps or to be killed. He earned his nickname as the Angel of Death through his inhumane experiments that he performed on twins, where he would often torture children to see how long it would take them to die. He even sewn people together in an attempt to create conjoined twins. His cruelty even extended to forcing parents to kill their own children. 400,000 people were sent to the gas chambers on Joseph's orders. Number 6. Maximilien Robespierre Maximilian was the leader of the French Revolution, where he imprisoned the current royals. He promised to bring freedom to France along with a better standard of living. But once he was in power, his attitude soon changed. He became obsessed with sending people to their death through guillotine. He executed whole families and even his own friends for not supporting his views. In a 10-month period, he was responsible for executing 40,000 people. Also, hundreds of thousands of people died through the battles of his revolution. Though in 1794, France finally had enough of Maximilian's rule, and he was executed without trial through his own favourite form of punishment, the guillotine. Number 7. Heinrich Himmler Another of Hitler's group, 
Himmler was the second most powerful Nazi that strongly implemented Hitler's final solution to the Jewish problem. He also pushed forward other means of ethnic cleansing. He was responsible for 7 million deaths from Polish, Russian and Jewish people. His home was furnished with furniture made from the bones and skins of Jewish people. So you get a real taste for how messed up this guy was. He killed himself in 1945 by eating poison. He was never faced with the charges for his crimes. Number 8. Saddam Hussein Saddam was the dictator of Iraq from 1979 till 2003. In his time of terror he had authorised many attacks on people through chemical warfare and killed around 100,000 Kurds during 1987 and 1988. He had many people tortured to death through electrocution and animalistic beatings that even included gouging out people's eyes. A horrifying 2 million people died due to Saddam's actions. He even had 40 of his own family members put to death. He was executed in 2006 by hanging from being found guilty of crimes against humanity by the Iraqi Special Tribunal. Number 9. Idi Amin Idi charmed his way to becoming Uganda's dictator during 1971 and 1979 by promising peace and democracy to his country. Instead, he became one of the most sadistic dictators of the 20th century. Around half a million people soon met their end from this man. Some were tortured to death whilst others were thrown into crocodile-infested waters. Some people were even buried alive. Amin would torture people by cutting off their body parts and forcing them to eat it. Amin was a proudly confessed cannibal and even ate the flesh himself and would even drink their blood. Idi Amin was forced out of his country but led quite a peaceful life until he died many years later. And finally, number 10. Adolf Hitler You all knew this asshole was going to be on here. Hitler started his murderous campaign in September of 1939 when he had invaded Poland. World War II had now begun. Hitler's main aim was to rid the world of the Jewish people, as he blamed the Jews for all of Germany's problems. Under Hitler's rule, he allowed savage, inhumane experiments and subjected millions of people to concentration camps, where people were tortured and treated worse than animals. Millions of people starved to death and many of them being put to death in gas chambers known as killing rooms. Hitler was personally responsible for 15 million deaths, but due to his actions, around 50 million people died. A truly horrific time for everyone. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. And try not to kill people like these guys did. That, that would be really nice.